4200 Lee Road. Uh, but what I'm trying to get at is like, uh, like you don't have to do as much like on the inside of a building like this as you would have to do on like say a house, right? If a house is in this condition, I mean you gotta. F there's so much work involved, right? Here, you just got to get the shell solid again, and then you got yourself like a big, ass, huge, fucking wide open building, right? A tool in your car that you've absolutely never used. <laughs> oh, oh my God! Holy shit! We can't go in here. There's a fucking jungle in there, dude. We can't get in. Why can't I? Why can't I get in there? Stuff right here. Well, I mean, I guess we could, but I can get in there. Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sale Show, folks. Thing is selling at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch to you, giving it to you straight. All right, y'all. We got a whoo. We got a little wild one for y'all today. Forty-two hundred Lee Road, Cleveland. All right, now this warehouse coming to you at $39,900. Now, that is a very deeply discounted price uh, because the property is very, very rough, right? It's been trashed, shredded. Uh, current owner, kind of an absentee owner, doesn't want to deal with it. Obviously, I feel like that's obvious. Once you get to the port, the pint uh, of ownership where, like, the roof caves in, y'all. It's kind of like, oh, you're checked. You're, you're done checked out, okay? Uh, we're starting the bidding at 39.9, but um, please, please, please submit. Bring any reasonable offers. We will be interested in discussing those with you because uh, he needs to liquidate this and, and get out of it, right? It's not like he's going there with a paint can and going to fix some shit up. Although the thing is, y'all, the cool thing is here with what – what you're doing in the commercial space with the like warehouse rentals and things of that nature, like, yeah, it looks like a bomb went off in the building. I'm not trying to be like one of those like you know, I'm like like them sixty year old, fifty year old white women realtors that are like, Oh, the home has all kinds of charm and it was uh, pride of ownership. And then you look at the house and it's like some fucking foreclosure with poop on the wall. Like, I'm not going to try to pull one of those moves on you. Obviously, this building looks fucking shredded because it's been shredded. Uh, but what I'm trying to get at is like, uh, like you don't have to do as much like on the inside of a building like this as you would have to do on like, say, a house, right? If a house is in this condition, I mean, you got to fucking there's so much work involved right here you just got to get the shell solid again and then you got yourself like a big ass huge fucking wide open building right like furnace plumbing electric like you'll probably want that stuff but like you're not framing out rooms you're not putting in vinyl tile things of that nature right you're you're really looking for storage here right garage storage self-storage that type of stuff right you probably get about 1500 Rent it to just one person. To be honest, if you're trying to do like self storage inside of there or something like that, splitting it up, you're gonna be able to get that rent way, 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 way higher. Um, but yeah, the actual cost, you're gonna put in a considerably large amount of money to get that shelf fixed, probably six figures. But it wouldn't be as bad as if you saw like a building like this and you had to like put it back together where like someone was going to live there. I guess that's the point I'm trying to make for you all. So submit your offers to my team, sales at holtonwise.com. We're only going to be accepting as is cash offers because uh, look at the fucking place, right? Uh, if you want to tour the property prior to submitting your offer to figure out how much you think it would be to put it back together, I think you should do that. No need to contact me to ask my permission. Just fucking go whenever the hell you want, right? I mean, you know, look at it. Look at it. Fucking slap a ladder on that son bitch and fucking climb the wall if you want, man. However you want to handle it, okay? Just uh, figure out what you want to do with it and then come to me with a no-nonsense, no BS offer, right? If you come to me with an offer of contingencies, I'm going to tell you to get the fuck out of my face because I don't want to hear any of those. As is cash offers only. Sales at HoltonWise.com. Let's go. Good. We're at this beautiful warehouse at 42 got the hiccups shit.
Oh yeah. Forty two hundred Lee Road. Got some cars parked here for some reason. The boys are over there working on them. You might not need to worry too much about the getting the roof. Uh, I don't think it exists. Don't think there's a roof, huh? I can see in one of the holes in the wall over there. That dude over there was like, there's fucking tons of raccoons in there. And I was like, I see the hole in the door. He's like, oh, they're just going up because there's no roof. He's like, they're just climbing up the tree going right in. I was like, oh. Holy shit. Like, there's a big one. Yeah, I can see there's no roof. Well, I mean, the drone footage is going to be pretty sweet, though. Yeah, I can see right there. There's no roof right there. Hold on. Nice. Call us. For all your property, maintenance, management, and sales. My friend Jorge Crowbar. <laughs> right. I am giddy with anticipation to get in here. What do you think? T25 or T20? Take your pick. 25. 25. That is correct. Yeah. He <laughs> said there's no roof. Raccoons just get right in. What, I was gonna say, what could that possibly be screwed into? I don't know. <laughs> that was a big one, though. Yep, I'm gonna go. Uh, I think this is the last one. Uh, you want to be here for the great deal? I do. You better believe it. But if my assumptions are right, I will not need this light. There's gonna be plenty of natural light yeah, in like there. A real good skylight. In there. Yeah. Oh, that's got the freaking rubber tip on. Imagine you have a tool in your car that you've absolutely never used. <laughs> Can't go in here. There's a fucking jungle in there, dude. We can't get in. Why can't I? Why can't I get in there? There's a bunch of stuff right here. Well, I mean, I guess we could, but I can get in there. You want me to go into the prayer front too? No, we'll go in here. Dude, it's fucking beautiful in there, dude. <laughs> this is everything I could have asked for. I didn't think the roof would be that bad. Derek, this is like the last one. Oh my god, it really is. This is like... Dude, are we going to get the fucking cordyceps? <laughs> Yo. 
Yeah. We should have brought a chainsaw, dude. Yo, hold on. We gotta get a re I gotta get a reveal. Put it back and forth. <laughs> I don't think you're gonna get the same response. The same. Uh, no, but I'm already in shock. Yeah. All right, here's the stage this reveal. <laughs> this is literally. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's so cool in here. I, I don't know about you guys. I'm fucking go. I'm going in. Dude. It's a fucking bucket hanging. I think you should totally go to the second floor as well. If I if I can find stairs, I will. There's birds living in here. I hear them. Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! Oh, almost died. You got tennis trap? Not recently. But I think we're fine. Most of the garage is on the ground and the roof is on the ground. Everything's on the ground. This place is fucking sweet. Oh, you know what? It was on fire at some point. Yeah. Yeah, I see some burnt beams. Oh, oh yeah, I see that right there. I'll put my grill. Okay. Take, take your time. I think it'd be pretty safe. And oh, I don't think we can get to the second floor. That's a lot of cash registers. Dude, if this was a video game, there would be treasure up there. This is just a pallet hanging from the ceiling. Ah oh, man, there's just so much shit we can't get to. Yo, this garage door is not on the wall. It's on the floor. Yeah, watch your step. Oh, I mean, a lot of this building is on the floor. Good pan. Where's all the raccoons? Okay. Well, there's a ladder, so we climb up to the next level. And, uh... I don't think it's safe. <laughs> Are you sure? It's not safe. You guys like my new friend? Oh man, we might need to go through the front too, because yeah. it looks like there's an yeah, open. Yeah. Well, no, I mean to like get more footage. Is this glass? Ha, it was. It was. That was too. Was this a greenhouse or something? I don't even know. I got that bird. Vince found a bird. Dude, you should hang from that chain and see if you can pull it. Hope this person doesn't mind me breaking all this shit. You want me to go to the front and see about pulling off some of the other man doors? Yeah. Dude, we can just cut through that hole right there. Come on, now. Yeah, but... Just traverse through there. Just walk right through it, dude. Dude, I feel like I got tight for a second think? and walked this, in. Should this be our first, uh... It's our first <laughs> fix and flip? Our first endeavor? What yeah, the yeah. fuck is that bucket yeah, doing? Yeah, There's that. one over here, too. Yeah. And here. It isn't helping with the rain. Yeah. <laughs> It was the initial leak fix. Just hang a fucking bucket that'll just fill and overflow. There's like old lady shoes over here. A lot of fucked up electrical shit. A lot of chairs. Cultural connection, right? Yeah, I think we gotta at least try to get in through that front just so I can see the. Because it looks like there's a path there to whatever that middle room is. This. This is the coolest mo 
post-apocalyptic shit I've ever yeah, seen. Oh! <gasps> what the fuck? What are all these cassette tapes? Herb, Herb William Jr. Herb William Jr. Well, I mean, get a lot of good footage of the. Uh, oh, I don't want to throw it that way. Roof and shit, and then. Yeah. Oh, somebody threw a cassette at me. Oh no. Oh no. Did you get most of this room? Yeah, I've planned this whole room. <laughs> You're living this is it, dude. Straight out of the license. You are. Li I love that. This like shit. Like when my friends ask me, like, dude, what do you like do? I absolutely. I love this banner. Yeah. It looks like it was like a flag of like some raider. Yeah. That's yeah. This is our camp now. We live here. Yeah. This. <laughs> no big. Yeah, that's the thing. Do you guys see all those cash registers over there? I don't know. I was gonna make my way to it and check it out. I mean, we're this deep. There's no point in not checking it out. Everywhere I step, I yeah. Everywhere I step, I break something. Yeah. Look at this piece of fucking gutter hanging right over my goddamn head. Yeah, dude, it's safe. Everything in here is safe. This is up to, to code and is moving ready. She put a sign on the front that says hard hat here, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, we're pulling the off the front then, huh? Okay. Yeah, I just want to be able to get... There's a room up there that's not totally fucked. So... I know it's a hand, but, like, why? I don't know. I, I have a loose grasp on what was done here. I'm imagining it was some kind of... Seems kind of like a hall. Yeah. Look at all these chairs. With all the chairs here. And they had a fire that fucked this place beyond imagine, so... Yeah. I thought this place was fucked before the fire. Fire didn't help. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Oh my god, I'm sinking. Hey, this is a couch, or it was a couch. Yeah. Alright, cool. Buy the auto level off. Let's fucking level up. Level. Found your golf ball. Oh yeah, I was looking for that. I hit that. I shanked it on four. Yeah, please. I'm done in here. I'm sorry, dude. I'm trying not to step on all these rusty fucking nails on the ground. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Fucking people throwing shit at me. Uh, I'm trying to clean up some of the litter out here. You want to take something? Yeah, hold on. It's <laughs> stuck on my wrist. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like an axe. Yeah. <laughs> this place is sweet looking. This fucking place is sweet, dude. Thank you. Yeah, it's definitely one of the... Uh, it's one of the places of all time. It's one of the places I've definitely been inside. I almost wonder if even that door will get us to that middle room. Could be fucking collapsed up there too. Oh no. Get the star bits first. Oh no. What happened? Still filming? Yeah, I was hitting the wrong the wrong buttons. Why'd you do that? Oh no, what did I do now? What have I what have I done? Oh my god. Did you not lock one of them? No, I hit one of the buttons on the That's my face. This is the footage. I'll put them back in my pocket, but 
that was the footage they all wanted. The camera slowly flipping <laughs> over to show my face. Yeah, dude. And so it's not the gimbal batteries doing that. No. Those are the new ones. Well, it's down to two bars, so. I mean, honestly, for safety, don't go in there. Yeah, it's not one that we should leave open. Uh, yeah. I can't leave a lockbox, so... What <laughs> What door would you put it on? I don't know, I guess you want to get in. If you want to get in, bring a drill and a T25. Yeah? Absolutely. I haven't seen the Phillips. For some yeah. reason, Two people, types. Up. people before me, the Jack-Offs. The Jag-Offs? Phillips, too. Mm. Bunch of fucking Jag-Offs. <laughs> Damn Jackbirds. <laughs> yeah, that's not what I expected in there. That was actually pretty dope. Yeah. I mean, I was expecting it to Yeah, to, up. to be in disrepair. <laughs> I knew there was a hole in the roof. I just didn't know it was the whole the roof. The whole roof. The whole goddamn thing. Jones put his in the sweet. They could like CGI in like playable Flickers. characters right oh, into yeah. that shit. And it's, it's literally a video game scene. Fuck it. Hey, I see another Hummer. That's, sign, dude. That's a sign. Be able to find one for two grand? No, that's probably why we'll Not get the. That's probably why we'll get the Ranger or an S10, little custom S10. We can get a. Uh, what are those Japanese flatbed trucks called? Mini truck? Yeah, mini truck. They're made by like Suzuki, Mitsubishi makes one, and then what? some. You ever seen those on the internet? Those little two-person trucks with the flatbed? They got one in Trailer Park Boys in the last couple seasons. Remember the truck that they're driving everything around? Bubbles truck? Yeah. It's uh, one of those. Yeah. Alright, this last one is the hard. Oh my god, make it impossible for people to get in. Go ahead and strip those all out for us. Yeah, right? I'm impatient. You want to see this thing? Well, you better watch the video because we stripped all of the nails or all the screws. Alright, let's try and get another way. This is over a 20 minute video for fucking an open room. I mean, this is a lot of open, open room. Extremely open floor plan. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, if you got the money, this would be a cool little spot to like just fuck around in. We should go in this way or through the front front? Well, so it seems like there's stuff falling out the bottom. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, maybe the front front. Can we even get in the front? Big ass foot. I think there's a man. There's door a little man door right? behind that one car. No, there's not. Oh, there's not. What the fuck? Alright, let's just do it. Let's go in this side one. Pop it off and take a look. I can't imagine the front looks any different than the back. <laughs> what? What do you mean? She's perfectly. <laughs> we started renovating, we just didn't make it to the back. Man, it's pretty cool that all that shit's falling out of the door, though. Yeah. It gives you a glimpse of what you got to look forward to. One screw and the fucking whole wall falls in. <laughs> we just leave, send the video, and like, hey man, maybe we rethink selling this. Uh, it fell. That might be it.
Oh, I see one here on the left side. That's actually... There's a few. I don't know if this one's in it. That one's no. not in it. Unfortunately, we don't own it, and we can't control what they do with it once we stop management, but if you have any situation, we should be okay. Good. If you could in the application you submitted, I imagine it will help. Bro, we want me to fucking tell you. You're gonna get kicked out. Who you talking to? Daddy? No. No. Fucking, uh... Oh. <laughs> Swinging door? We, we can get in? We can't get in? I mean... <laughs> oh, fuck, no, we can't get in. <laughs> well, this is the front half. I hope you guys enjoyed our little tour. <laughs> yeah, it looks like there's a lot going on in there, but... I like that you took all the screws off one side and now it's just a swinging door. Started swinging. That sucks, man. There's no way to the front. That's not like the most dangerous path of all time. This whole building will come down any minute. I am seeing a lot of vertical cracks. <laughs> Peekaboo. So. Oh, that, wait. That was cool. That was actually pretty cool. Right on the road here. There's even a place for you to put a sign. Is this crazy guy trying to go in there? He's trying to look to see if, if we can pop off something in the front. Like, yeah, it's hard to know. It, yeah, it looks I think like, that's why all the boards in the front look like they are falling off. Yeah, got a bunch no, of there's shit pushing you see that against white them. Corrugated board? Yeah. That's, there's no door there, but then the piece next to it that would be covering there is like falling. Yeah. I don't know if you can pop the camera and get it. Shot of that. Mm. So quick, See what I'm talking about though? Just to the, to the right of the white. <clears throat> yeah, there's shit all over the floor in front of it. It's like. You could probably it's like totally poke it in and point the camera the other way. Ah, what the fuck? See the back. You want to see that way too. Probably about good enough. Um, That's just where we were earlier. Yeah. <laughs> it's just the other side of that, like, somewhat upper section. A drone would be pretty sweet. Yeah, it's been boarded up for a while too. The windows that are boarded up off top are all warped. Or the, uh, the boards on them are all warped. Yeah. Okay. So. That's pretty good. If you were homeless, would you go in there? No. I'm gonna really keep you dry. No. I think I'd rather stay on the streets. I stay under a bridge. It's all dry rotted down there too, so your your screw's not gonna stick. What are you doing? When I undone, oh, yeah. and that is it. I, it. I like that you can peek around and see the frame. Okay. Alright. Another successful old blue eyes trip.
Big thumbs up. Good job, team. Good job. Go, team, go. Yeah, that place was duh. Okay. All right. Okay. 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 Hell yeah. Thumbs up. Fucking camera. Just started break dancing. Come on. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Oh, she's on to sleep. All right. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.